lockdown is on until the country's biggest bank faces its biggest hurdle and more shareholders are coming forward calling for Ken Lewis to step down. News Channel 36 reporter Michelle Bowden has the details. This is the most tumultuous and probably the most significant annual meeting we've ever seen. Ken Lewis in the fight of his life as next week's shareholders meeting inches closer. Anything goes next Wednesday. We'll have to wait and see how this plays out. The latest to publicly declare plans to boot the B of A chairman and CEO, Connecticut's treasurer. That state owns 3.2 million shares of B of A stock because of a $20 billion pension fund. The treasurer there says, quote, it's time to clean house. And the treasurer wants to separate Lewis's current title as chairman and CEO into two different jobs. And just last month, a Texas family with more than a million B of A shares launched a web campaign trying to get other shareholders to oust Lewis and split the position too. We are asking them to vote along with us to, uh, to change the corporate governance at Bank of America. UNCC banking professor Tony Plath says the board may offer a concession and split the position, but he says that could ultimately signal the end of Lewis's fight. It can be a harbinger of bad things to come. And the shareholders' vote is next Wednesday. Many not expected to actually announce their vote until then. Reporting live now in the newsroom, Michelle Bowden, News Channel 36. Some good news.